Hi, this is George from George's Insects and today I am going to do a video on uh, how to keep Indian stick insect eggs. So there's my Indian stick insect enclosure over there. This species is, uh, the Latin name of this species is Carassius morosus. Uh, and there are eggs in there from today. What I like to do is I, get, I like to get these very small little jar things. Um, put a cut around bit of uh, paper towel um, for the bottom uh, to keep a bit of moisture. Um, and I like to also label the bottom with the date, um, the name, so Cimarosus, and that they are eggs. Um, the date helps with the hat the sorry the uh, laying date helps with finding out the hatching date so it's about four months uh so you'll be able to have a rough idea so um that's what i recommend keeping them in obviously before they hatch you want to have like a cover so what i do is i put very thin cloth over it like very thin uh, material like this net here over the stick insect closure very thin material like that over them with a rubber band i'll see not yet in a month or two i'll do that um so yeah that's you could uh, do the same there's different substrates that different people recommend i recommend paper towels but in general indian stick insects are really easy indian stick insect eggs are really easy to hatch so you could use vermiculite or um or paper towel um, and give them a l very light spray once a day, depending on where you live. Um, th they lay about five eggs each every day, and they are nocturnal, so if you take them out in the morning, put them in each individual jar, and then you'll be able to have an idea of when they'll hatch. Um, <coughs> sorry, um, but yeah, that's what I would recommend. Otherwise, if you have like a bioactive enclosure with sprinklers and ice pods and like a, a soil based substrate, then you can actually leave them in the enclosure and um, don't get it too moist, otherwise mold can form on the eggs and that will kill the stick insects inside. Um, but ice pods and sprinklers should help to get, make, make sure that that mold doesn't uh, get to them because if if the eggs start to mold over then the spring tails and ice pods will tend to eat the mold off um but yeah that's a basic um introduction to um into incubating stick insect eggs uh specifically indian stick insect eggs obviously it varies between species but uh if you have any more information make sure you do your research go and check out my website www.georgeinsects.com and there'll be more information there on that. So thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please do give it a thumbs up and please do consider clicking that subscribe button. Thank you.